The event is almost coming to an end. We will now have the Q&A session, the last session of the event. Many of the questions have already been answered in the Q&A box. And due to the time limitation, we can't answer all the questions, but we will try to focus on the questions that most of you have asked. The questions will be answered by our student, Torishit Banerjee, Dr. Yumiko Watanabe, specially appointed professor and the coordinator for the Future Global Leadership Program, Dr. Derek Mott, specially appointed associate professor, and Dr. Kazuya Yoshida, professor in the Department of Aerospace Engineering. So first, I would like to ask a question to Dr. Watanabe. Uh, what are the requirements to receive the scholarship? Yes, uh, you, uh, I should say, please get the higher score, high score at the application. And also the examination uh, we provided at the second stage screening. Uh, however, I'd like to say this FGL undergraduate program uh, has a eight reserved seat for Japanese government scholarship. That means different from the embassy recommendation system, it's a university recommendation system. It is competitive. However, you have a very good chance to get that very prestigious scholarship to just apply to the FGL uh, program. I can say, and uh, some of the graduate uh, program also has a reserved seat for Japanese government scholarship. In addition to that, Tohoku University offered a very unique fellowship money that's equivalent money of the tuition fee. You have a very good chance to get the financial support. Thank you very much. Professor Watanabe. And next question is about um, the course. And this question is for Dr. Mott. Is there a computer science course in English? Okay, uh, this is a very good question. Uh, we get this a lot. There is a no dedicated computer science course taught completely in English at this time but computer science would fall under the IMAC-U designation as an engineering subdiscipline. So if you want to study computer science in English, your best bet would be to apply to IMAC-U and try to join a professor's course there specializing in computer science. Ah, thank you. Thank you very much, Dr. Mott. And next question is for Dr. Yoshida about your special lecture. And the question is, what else are the challenges of operating robot on the lunar or Mars surface? And how can we overcome it? Such as temperature, gravity, power, remote operations. Okay, yeah, thank you very much for this question. Uh, it's a very dedicated question. As uh, the question says, the, uh, there are a lot of the issues to be solved. The, but most of them are the engineering questions and how to deal with uh, the uh, uh, temperature and vacuum and a uh, difficult uh, environment and also the uh, very long distance for the uh, remote uh, communications as well. And that's why that we need uh, the high level of the autonomy. So that's why that the AI based technologies are, are so important. So uh, actually, that um, I have a, uh, we have a background on the mechanical engineering, and so the yeah, we are uh, our members, our faculty members are very good at de dealing with uh, such uh, the um, uh, mechanical engineering issues and structure, temperature, and such and such. But also the uh, um, electrical engineering or computer science dealing with the um, artificial intelligence and such and such. So um, yeah, that space uh, programs or space missions to to space are not easy issues. So we need a great inter integration of the quite a lot of the different disciplines. 
So, so that's why that um, the Tohoku University has a certain advantage because we have a, a top of uh, researchers in, in this university. So I hope uh, this answers to, to the question. Thank you very much. And the next question goes to Tori. And are there any entrepreneurship opportunities at Tohoku University? Yeah, thank you for that question. And that's a question which um, uh, I often get from students once they join the university. Uh, yes, there are entrepreneurship opportunities. Tohoku University has something called as a Tohoku University Startup Garage. And um, they provide business advice and uh, incubation support. And um, even there are many co-working spaces available on two of our campuses, uh, which are really supportive of if you have any entrepreneurial ideas. So there is support for entrepreneurship on the campus and you just need to go out and participate in those contest and sessions and you will definitely get it. Thank you. I would like to ask you another question, and I think many of the audience may be interested in this question. How long does it take to learn the Japanese language? <laughs> uh, uh, I, I wish I can say forever, but <laughs> but uh, actually speaking, um, I came with no lang no knowledge of Japanese, and I didn't even grow up watching anime, so I have no no knowledge of Japanese at all. So, uh, but uh, Tokyo University uh, uh, in the in the first one and a half year, three semesters, uh, we had one class per day uh, every week. Uh, and that really helped me in picking up all the basic things I needed to learn about Japanese. And I could, uh, I got the conversational skills, which I sometimes try on the professors around here. <laughs> and, uh, and I try to speak in Japanese. And uh, so I can say at least one and a half years with the university-based support, nothing extra. You can actually have conversational skills and rest, you can join clubs and circles and uh, pick up on more of your Japanese skills and you can always shine better. Thank you. Thank you very much, Tori-san. Um, I would like to ask next question to Dr. Yoshida about your lecture. How do you think about the Mars settlement plan? What makes us difficult to realize this plan? And if possible, when will the plan come true, do you think? <laughs> okay, yeah, thank you for a great question. And so first of all, I personally would like to go to the moon during my life, but uh, the mass should be a, a next goal. So then uh, the, 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 the one of the difficulty, top level difficulty is a distance. And then it takes a uh, um, longer time uh, to arrive um, on, the, on the mass. So uh, typically it takes um, you know, uh, nine months, 10 months. And so just for one way. So, so then, uh, yeah, they stay over there, then I find the opportunity to return that it may take uh, three years altogether. So, so then uh, we need to establish that the very safe, uh, uh, the technology yeah, uh, to make sure that such an expedition is possible. But uh, well, so far, um, thanks to the uh, great robotics missions, uh, we already know that water is there and then uh, the ancient time that the surface of the Mars was covered with big ocean, so like the Earth. So then we have a great potential to find that evidence of life. So then there are a um, um, uh, large number of reasons and we should go to there and we should confirm the uh, dif different form of the life in, in this universe, for example. So there are, we, we, there, there are um, a quite a lot of the challenging issues waiting for us over there. So maybe in your generation, younger generation, you will find uh, the time uh, to, to go to Mars seriously. Maybe it happens in 10, 20 years from now. So yeah, that, that is my, my idea, my comment. Thank you very much. So we're running out of time. So next question with the final question. And the question is, what kind of career path are possible after graduation? Dr. Watanabe, can you, can you answer that question? OK, uh, because <clears throat> I, I'm sorry. All FGL course, uh, you know, uh, for undergraduate students is subject is either science or engineering, STEM subject. That's why more than 70% of the uh, students continue their study at graduate school. 
uh, both at the Tohoku University or other you know, area, including uh, North America, Europe. And then many of the students who complete the master degree start to work at the Japanese company. And some of them work at their home country. And maybe 10, 20% of the students continue their research and study for getting the PhD. That's normal, you know, fraction of the career for the FGL. Okay, thank you very much. We have received much more questions, but due to time limitation, please let me end this Q&A session now. Thank you very much for all the questions.